It's sponsored by St. Elizabeth Healthcare. A new test in the works could help men discover a certain type of cancer. Liz Bonus joins us with what local experts are saying about it. Liz. Hey Paula, good evening once again. We talked to the cancer team at St. Elizabeth Healthcare to find out more about this new test. It is called an ISO-PSA and it has the potential, they say, to reduce the number of unnecessary biopsies performed. And here's why. The traditional PSA is based on a concentration in the blood. It can be high due to everything from an enlarged prostate to an infection. This new ISO-PSA so the ISO-PSA is a new PSA uh, test that is structural based. That means if used in addition to the traditional test and other discussions of family history. The hope is that we can better select patients who are at risk for developing uh, prostate cancer. The ISO-PSA was the subject of a recent report from the Cleveland Clinic. They supplied this video. Since many men get biopsies where no cancer is discovered, they were looking at two things. They were looking at the ISO-PSA uh, and an actual number there, plus they were looking at uh, better directed uh, biopsy, which uh, they used MRI guidance as opposed to ultrasound guided biopsy. Dr. Shaw says with those two parameters, they found that they're more successful in identifying uh, high-risk prostate cancer patients. He points out that this test is still in research and development and it is not available yet for individual patients. But he said it would add one more potential tool inside a toolbox that would allow patients to get ideally the proper diagnosis and future treatment. I think PSA will probably still be uh, around for a while. You know, we've used it for many decades and it's been a great test. But the question will be certain patients might benefit from an ISO PSA in addition. Now this information is based on a study in the journal Urology. No word yet on how soon this new ISO PSA test might be on the market. As always, questions for providers at St. Elizabeth Healthcare are welcome. Go to local12.com and submit them through Ask the Experts.